Hi everybody, it is Granny. We just went to see the Panther movie by Marvel. Oh Lord, I have not been to a really good movie in a lot of years. That was an exquisite, exquisite movie. I like a sci-fi anyway, but this is the Marvel. It's the Black Panther. Oh, awesome! So you get a chance to stop and want to see something. If you're a Marvel person, if you, you like those, you'll love this movie. Go and see it. Granny out. Hi, it's me again. I'm going to do some clips of things because so many of you are coming out this summer and you're newbies. So, this is only Granny's opinion. I am not God. It may not work for you. Maybe you can't afford it. Okay? First of all, everyone on here is chasing the internet. I'm not a chaser. I don't have time for stuff like that. Okay? I make my videos. When I want something, I want something. When I want to get on there and go Google, I want Google. I want my maps. I want my maps. Okay. I would choose, because I've had Verizon for 10, 12 years now, and everywhere I've traveled, I have had internet. Occasionally you'll get into up to the mountains in Colorado where you cannot get Verizon, but it's usually the top one to get. I have, I pay 140 a month for unlimited gigabytes. I have video everywhere that I go. I have internet where I go so I can search stuff. I don't like going to Walmart or to here or somewhere and clicking onto somebody else's internet. It's not Granny Joe. Okay? Also, sorry, I have my tablet on. See, I watch movies. Oh, it's plugged in. Sorry. Anyway, I have my tablet. For my tablet and this is a 10, an old, old tablet. Anyway, for that and for my phone, I have unlimited gigabytes, like I said, um, and I pay 140 a month. To me, it is well worth it because I do not have to chase internet. When I want to Google something and find something, if I want to Google it where the next town is, where the next travel, you know, pilot, love, wherever I'm going, the park, uh, you can even get some of the maps up and they even have, um, rest stops on them okay so I want this when I need it I don't want to be sitting in Timbuktu and not have internet or service so I went to Verizon and I spend the money so if you can't do that then you'll have to choose for yourself but that's just me I don't have time for stuff so Verizon is my best bet okay next thing I want to talk about is where to go to travel how does Granny get around? Well, when Granny started out in June, I knew nothing except for freecampsites.net. That got me through and around, and now I've learned about Cabela's, Home Depot, Walmarts, truck stops, empty lots, okay? What do I use for protection, ladies? I have pink mace. It's, it's a little can. You can buy it. I bought mine at Academy. Uh, it's a can of pink mace. I have a horn. A very loud boat horn. And they hang up by the door. So I know right where to grab them. Uh, the pink mace sleeps with me if I'm in a spot where I'm uncomfortable. Um, those are my two things. Plus I do have a few knives here, here, and there. Okay, I'm not a gun person. I'm sorry. Uh, but those... And I have a baseball bat by the door. So, I'm not unprotected. But I've never... There's Maybe I'm different. If I... If the hairs on the back of my neck set up... And I feel uncomfortable about a spot... I get behind the driver's seat... And I'll go another 5 or 10 miles. Or I go to another truck stop. Okay? I go somewhere else that I feel better. Right, the other night, I took off really early from a Walmart, and it was dark. And then I seen deer alongside the road, and I thought, I ain't running my rig for no freaking deer. So, I went a little farther, then I found a 
picnic area and even though it was dark as heck I had Miss Tippy so I wasn't too worried about that so um but I didn't I didn't sleep I just didn't want to drive I was afraid of hitting a deer and running my rig and so early morning driving is very hard for that and very late evening driving so these are a couple more tips that you want to put on your list, okay? You have to pay attention out here. Um, there's there's Campendium too. I don't know how to spell that. I'd have to look it up, and I don't know where I wrote that. But it is another free campsites.net. Campendium. I don't know how they spell it. Camp. And... Um, there's BLM land. You can always put that in. There's several others. You can go to Bob's and get any of this information. Before you leave home, set these things up. Also, if you're not going to travel and have Verizon, where you can usually always have service, get you a good map a rallies or something that has all your roads in it. I'm lucky enough that I'm with my friend. So I copy everything off. Like I know I'm going to be in Colorado. I know I'm going to go to Utah and Nevada and Wyoming. So I copy them. I put them in laminated forms and I put them in my drawer. So that when I get to these states, I can pull them out. It's like I have the New Mexico State Park Pass and I have one laminated with all the state parks in it um, so that I can go and use them. So these are just tips because so many of you want to come out here. These are things you need to consider long before you leave there so that you can get them and get set up. Okay? The phones at Verizon are very expensive. The one I'm cam videoing on is the Galaxy 8 Plus, And I think it was $700. But I pay it out month to month because I've had an account with them for a very long time. The only place that you can't go in like, I use uh, stylers and different things. Um, my case on this came off. I just bought it in another state. I'm going to take it in. But I'm sure they won't replace it. They won't put anything in your account in Texas. Okay, that's the weirdest place. They want you to pay taxes and pay for it. They're not used to that. Because in Missouri, I walk in. I give them my whatever. Where was I when I went in? I was in um, Yuma went in no problem okay had a styler put right on so sir so every state is a little bit different uh, but I've never had a problem with Verizon so I highly recommend them but you do what's best for you and what you can afford uh, and these are only my opinion I am not God I'm not anything so there goes that there's granny's opinion on that one 